Hello everybody, it's Romeo with Battle Foam once again here to protect your army. And how are we going to do that? With brand new revolutionary case systems called the PAC system. What does PAC stand for? Personal Army Combat Kit. And guess what? We have a new bag that we have just launched called the PAC 216. What is the 216? Well, it's a bag that holds 216 troops or it's made more specifically for the small gamer out there that plays an epic size or maybe a Flames of War type of game system or maybe an Aeronautica. Something that's not massive in size but needs a place to be held. Or better yet, for the guy out there that's the modeler, the guy that's the hobbyist, the true core of the gaming system, the guy that just wants to paint his model, guess what? This bag is for you. This will hold over 200 paint pots inside of it in just three inches of space. And how does it do that? Well, first of all, let's go over the bag itself. You have the rugged plastic shell that all of our bags come in. These bags are not going to give out on you. Along with that, you have the 3M covered canvas material. This stuff's also going to keep water out, be resistant to the weather, and give you a stronger material. Now, along with that, we have a zipper system that's really well built. And we have side pouches that were used or designed with the, with the user in mind. For instance, a place for your cell phone. Another one on the other side for a place for your wallet or maybe some other little gadget that you may have. And more than anything, a place to store your business cards. If you're a painter out there and you have business cards and you're trying to commission some work, what a great place to tuck those business cards in. Along with that, you'll notice we have two handles here. You have a choice to hold them like a briefcase or you can carry it like a tote. Now the good thing about it is this is also modular. And you'll see very soon that all of our bags are modular, meaning that we have a zipper on here that will zip on top of the 1520 so you can interchange pieces in our bags and you don't have to stick to one type of bag. Now, let's get inside this guy and see what it has to offer. So we zip it like so, coming around to show you the audience at home, and voila, what do we got in here? A place already designed to put your paint, or I'm sorry, you put your paint brushes. What a great way to transport your, your actual brushes themselves that are tucked into corners or put into boxes or just tossed inside of a case. Here they sit nice and flush, easy to pick out. If you're painting, you're just going to pull it out and say, I need brush number two, pull it right out. Easy peasy, no problem at all. Super fun. Along with that, you have a place for files, different small tools that actually will fit in here. Now, we talked about the small epic gamer out there, the small guy that plays maybe Flames of War, and guess what? We've thought about you too when designing these. We've designed a system that will carry those, those game types in their whole type of point, uh, point value. So what you'll have here, for instance, is this tray that holds Flames of War. Check this out. You have a place for your command. You have a place for your rifle companies. Boom, fits right in there with ease. Along with that, another tray for just rifle company or just rifle or some of the larger base models that you'll notice. For instance, this vehicle fits right in, not a problem. Boom, right there. A place for your vehicles. Look at that. What a wonderful way to transport these small, fragile miniature models. Toss them in there. Close this guy right up. Zip it all shut. And check this out. This system is closed and ready to go. You have your whole army inside this nice, comfortable case. And guess what? You can put this right on top of the 1520. Zip it on. Take your Warhammer army along with it. And now you can play any game system. So again, guys. Check this out. It's on our website. It's a great new bag, the PAC 216, designed for you and mine. Thank you very much. We'll see you again soon.